The Indian tectonic plate is the fastest northward moving plate on the planet. Perhaps this phenomenon of nature may have developed in Indians the technique of becoming an Urdhvareta called yoga. The collision of these two plates created an amazing phenomenon on Earth. The formation of the fastest and continuously rising mountains, the Himalayas. Perhaps due to this continuously upward movement, the Himalayas became the abode of the yogis. The Himalayas are not ordinary mountains. This biggest mountain range is the axis mundi of the Earth's climate. It is from here that the climate of the Earth is governed and will continue to influence it in the future. The Himalayas have bestowed three gems to the land of India. First, the monsoon. Second, fertility. And third, spirituality. Monsoon clouds descend here. Perhaps they come to salute the crown of the earth. On reaching the Himalayas, they pour heavily on India's soil. This is not fog. These are clouds, that is, Meg. Right now, we are in the Ale of Meg, Meghale. This place gets the maximum rainfall on the planet. The upward movement of the Indian land nurtures spiritualism, and the downward movement of the rivers nurtures life. This population density has not survived anywhere on Earth, but here, this abundance of drinking water is nowhere to be found on Earth. Monsoon clouds descend here on the subcontinent. When monsoon clouds hit the high mountain ranges, large chunks of earth dissolve and flow down, forming the most fertile lands on earth, producing three crops a year. <laughs> 